to what I do is when a person cannot uh, justify what he has or fail to declare as a constitution specified, some of them swore to Almighty God that the property didn't belong to them until we show them their bank accounts and their companies which they gave them some contract, then we have some peace. Uh, so we are recovering as much as we can under the system. And this time around, I said the properties should be sold and the money be put in the treasury. The last time they were given back their structures. Now this time, whoever comes out of me, no matter how generous he seems, he cannot take the money from the treasury and give it to individuals. That would be impossible. But anybody who cannot account for what he has for lack of for refusing to declare or refusing uh, to show it. <laughs> the question is, we want to build a nation and have always believed in our diversity for prosperity, not for adversity. And uh, you know, progressive thinkers like a president, you know, must join hand to build the country. No matter what, this nation, you have nothing but one country. And that's the only way that we can stimulate growth and understanding among various nationalities in this country. It's, it's not by division. It's not by promoting uh, uh, religious conflicts religious differences, uh, nobody has control when they were born, what they will be, how they will be raised, and how their faith will affect their life. And we must remove that from our political setting, set it aside, build a nation, and concentrate on uh, trust and development. Thanks. Thank you.